in previous tutorial uh, we have checked how to create a database from our own data also I have discussed with you how to create it with the uh, sample tab separated values which you can do the same with excel sheet or you can say google doc spreadsheet or from csv or tsv files okay now will this time check another way to create our app this time we are going to go for marketplace apps so let's delete our previous application okay now let's create something new okay we have option for importing which we have already checked in previous tutorial after that there is from scratch and now we will check for applications from the marketplace you have sales management order management idea set employee management and event management okay so if you want to go with any of these templates then let's just see we can go with employee management now let's click on install when you click on install it should create an app in your dashboard with all the sample data and fields created already for you it's it just takes some time for installation okay after installation it will automatically redirect us to this application now we have to go and check this application to see what is inside okay so our app is completely ready with the sample data like creating a pub employee profile which is good okay so first thing we have to do is register within this application then we can use these features like add leave approved leave team leaves and reports okay so let's go back to the home page so we can have apply leave and view holidays okay admin will add or remove holidays here also you can have employees to add their own leave okay so they can select the name then from which date to which date leave type which is optional casual and sick leave there is also team mail id and reason for leave which will be stored so that admin can check who is on leave and the report for that leave let's check the back end of this app Okay, so we are here to check the backend for add and remove leave. So what we have here is a simple form where there is employee type. Okay, name and ID. Okay, then there is from which is basically a date picker same with the two both are these date picker which you can select from this field tab and there is email field which is for team then there is status which admin or moderator will approve or deny or allow then there is a reason for leave which is to be filled by person who wants to leave or the moderator okay so come back to the dashboard and you'll find that all that form within your applications this application has multiple forms like announcement calorie department dependent education 
employee profile, role, holidays, leave, office location, and many other small forms. So basically what this application does is you get to manage all your employees and the tasks related to them. Okay, so this is one way to start from the application which is already created for you in marketplace gallery so if your requirements match with any such applications like employee management sales team or invoices then you should use one of these apps if you don't need this app or you don't want to use such apps for your requirement then you can go back to your app directory where you can just click on this row and then delete it it will ask you if you want to delete or not just click on delete and it will be gone so what we have covered so far is first we have seen how you can create a database app from scratch in Zoho Creator after that I have shown you how you can use Excel sheet or TSV or CSV values to create your Zoho Creator apps and in third way I've shown you how you can just import the existing marketplace app for your requirements so these are three methods with which you can create Zoho Creator apps so I hope you have enjoyed this tutorial so far in future I will go ahead with the more complexity for the application and more apps for you to learn from if you have any questions or if you don't understand or have any trouble with the videos please let me know and I will try to improve my videos and oh, anything that you want me to improve on thank you and Bye.